I got a, what's this, an eight-man sled. I got an eight-man, and then I got another one over here. How many, I can't even see that far, bro. You trying to, okay. You're going to put a sign that small. I used to laugh at my daddy. You remember your daddy and your, your grandma and your mama. Boy, come here. And they get you and say, and they get the medicine. They'd be like, hey, how many pills I supposed to take? You know, you'd be laughing. Man, daddy, you can't even see this. Hey, man, you got to take one pill, man. You know, but now I catch myself. I got the medicine bottle. I'm like, eh, looking at it. So be careful what you do, man. You reap what you sow. That stuff will come back on you. All right. But right here, guys, I'm going to tell you now. Go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to break the code right now. And give you this, I'm going to bless you today. We used to have all these things here with pads, right? And so, how do you want your lineman hands to be on that guy? You want them thumbs up, right? Everybody want thumbs up. We can agree on that, right? But guess what, guys? We practice against a pad that's flat. So everything, we want this, but we practice that. Crazy. We want this, but we practice this. So, Pete Jenkins... One of my mentors, he came, He got this, 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 this pad right here. I don't have a flat pad out there. I took, you can see that little knot right there. So that knot right there is what we grab right there when we're talking about right here in the breastplate. That's that knot. Now, you're going to say, I, don't, I can't afford it. I don't have it. Y'all got big money in Texas. I've been, I've recruited Texas. I know all these stadiums and all that stuff. All right, none of you jokers don't coach and teach and all that stuff. All right. Just get you a towel. Get you a towel, wrap that thing up, and put it in the middle of that sled. It will change your life. That will change your life. Now, I'm going to tell you what's really going to change your life. So we was doing that, and then finally, we took the pads off one day. They were reconditioning them or something. So we ain't had no pads. It was just a bar. We got to practice. So we started grabbing that bar. I said, you know what, man, that's pretty good. Me and Randy Shannon said, you know what, man? Let's just take the pads off for six of them. So we got these two and these two down here. You can't see those. And we just wrapped tape around them. And that's all I practice on. And, guys, it will, it will force those guys to concentrate. They got to look at that bar to grab it. Because you know, I can't tell you, man, I'm so proud. I tell them, you can't, I can't tell you how many fingers I've jammed on this thing here. I'm so, I'll be so happy. I'm like, man, I said, I'm looking to jam two fingers today. And they know it. So they, guess what they do? They be, I mean, their eyes be wide open. And they strike that thing. And right here, like I said, we work out a two-point stand. So I want to see them because they're forcing them to, to grab it. It forces them to grab it. So I, I'll tell you right now, take them pads off. Just get you some old cushion, some foam, put it around there, and wrap it up. That ain't up with some old electric tape right there that you can find at the doggone uh, Dollar General somewhere. 